can't see my face at all. I only have about an hour or so here at the house before I have to go somewhere and I was wanting to get a little bit of swimming in. I have you guys in the shade so you don't overheat, but uh, I gotta get my hair up because I am not looking to do a full body shower because I don't even have time to do that after we swim. <laughs> That's so bad. I feel very fancy with my updo. Can you guys even see me? I know the light is really bad right here. It's gonna be very in your face. Oh yeah, that, mm, so cute. So from Amazon, I got one of these oversized visors. So let's take a look to see. It looked cute, okay, I promise you it did. But who's to say it's gonna look cute on me? <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, so cute. <laughs> we need some sunscreen. This is probably the smartest yet dorkiest thing which you probably know from the title of this video. But I want to show off my new life jacket I got. I got it from Amazon and the brand is Airhead. I'm literally just shifting feet right now because it's so hot on this travertine. But um, yeah, it seems probably a little dorky and yet incredibly intelligent of me to get a life jacket because sometimes I want to swim in the pool by myself. I could hit my head, I could get attacked by angry wasps, something could happen where I die. Nobody wants to come home to a dead body, especially one at the bottom of the pool, because that's like extra work to take care of, to drag the corpse out of the, it's very traumatizing, okay? I think my life jacket is too big, and I'm just, I need to come to terms with it that I gotta try to return it. It is $50 and nothing is more annoying than a life jacket that rides up into your neck and like on your ears. Like I hate that and it just, I won't use it then. This time around, they found it very appropriate to send me a life jacket in this gigantic box. And if this doesn't work, well, I don't know, it's probably just game over because I lost all motivation to repurchase another life jacket. And also, I have no idea what size to order. It's all or nothing. Oh yeah, nice and tight, but it's supposed to be comfortably snug. <laughs> I realize that every time I struggle with something, I grunt and groan, but I always regret it when I'm in editing and I see the footage and I just, oh, it's not cute. It is what I do. It is one of my quirks, okay? <laughs> It's tight! Enough with the grand unboxing. Let's get into the water. I have cut the tag off. I am committing to this. And if I don't like it, I'll probably just like never wear it. The moment of truth. Oh my gosh, it works. most professional opinion, I would say that this works. It is time to do the doggy paddle. <laughs> Your buoyancy shifts in all kinds of ways. <laughs> it's a little into my earlobes, but uh, I guess I don't really mind it now that I've gone it wet and therefore I cannot return said life jacket. But you know, it, it, it's fine. This is cool. <coughs> oh my god, everything burned. I know you guys are watching me struggle and you're a bit concerned as if I've never been in a life jacket before. 
and that is not the case. You know, as a lifeguard and competitive swimmer, co-captain, coach of the ward, you know, you don't really just like wear a life jacket. The issue is I don't have enough friends that have boats, but I've also made the mistake of not dating a guy with a boat. So if you were a guy with a boat and you like what you see, hit me up, I'm down. This is the ride along portion of the video where you get to truly experience this life jacket and just know how good I feel to be floating around in my pool like this. I swear. I know this sounds bad, but like, yeah, I kind of wish somebody was creeping on me right now just to see me, just to come, thinking I'm gonna be like in a bikini and this is what they see. But no, I shouldn't wish that, but oh my God. Oh, like a news copter. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at me. I'm in the deep end, unsupervised, totally safe, all by myself. All by myself, because I have no friends. It's a good thing I have you guys. <laughs> I forgot my goggles, one second. Don't worry guys, I did not forget my goggles that are pink, also like my pink life jacket. And within two seconds, she killed her OnlyFans career. What the hell? I thought because this was like a type of certified life jacket that I naturally float upright but instead I was face down. <laughs> oh my God, everything I told you is a lie. Okay, this is just so disappointing that, you know, if you fall on your side, yeah, you're gonna roll to your back, but the momentum is gonna keep you going, and then you're gonna roll to your front, and then you're gonna die. Oh, okay, let me at least just see if I were to perfectly land in the water on my back. Okay, should've held my nose. tags off man I can't return this I mean I guess maybe I could I don't know this would be like the second return from the same vendor I don't know how it works because I don't have prime because prime costs money and it's the biggest scam okay I said it it's a scam I'm not falling for it I will wait two weeks for my free shipping I don't care and that's why this video this is why this video is going live like at the end of summer. I'm gonna have to talk to my mommy about this to see if I should just try to return this life jacket because the whole point of this was for safety. It wasn't for fun. I mean, I'm having a blast, especially with you guys, but this just, because I was trying to get back into competitive swimming and then I saw the Olympics. <laughs> that was just a moth. Swimming with a life jacket, it's just, it's harder to do. It compromises your form. But I was willing to do that for the safety. But now where's the trade-off? I don't, I don't feel very safe. Do you see this? The ride up right now? I showed up to perform. I want to impress you guys. And so I'm going to attempt some professional strokes.
in so long. And that looked fantastic. This definitely cut into my neck. I really am more concerned for my safety more than ever. That it's gonna cut off my oxygen and slowly kill me. I guess that's the morbid review of this Amazon life jacket. I was gonna tell you to pledge to my Patreon because I was going to give you exclusive sexy life jacket footage and I don't think I can make that promise anymore, but I do hope to see you there on my Patreon. So thank you for watching. I love you. I mean it. Bye guys.